28 on Fox Docos or Watch On Demand. Rita Panning is going to be talking about George Soros and even more about uh, the behind the scenes story about how it was exposed about how golf clubs have now gone gender neutral. Seriously, that's a couple of minutes. We're here with Amanda Stoker with Holly Hughes. Now, Amanda, I talk about this a lot, which is you want kids that are smart enough to be able to go to uni and not have to matter whether they were born into the richest or poorest of families. Yeah, OK, a couple of seats for people that are right on the edge who can plead their way in. But yet another report shows that the bar is being constantly lowered for people who don't even qualify to go to uni who end up going to uni because we, the federal taxpayer, pay for everyone to go to uni. This is a flawed system, isn't it? At some point, like the ride at Luna Park, you must be this smart to ride. I do think there is a point at which we aren't doing anyone a service by sending them to university. I remember when I was teaching um, at one of the um, educational institutions, universities in Queensland, and you'd quite regularly find that you were submitted with assessment tasks that they just didn't make any sense. These people didn't have a basic mastery of the English language, let alone a mastery of whatever law subject I was teaching. <laughs> We weren't doing them any favours. We weren't doing the profession any favours. The only one who was doing any well out of this was the universities. Um, and so there needs to be some sort of a matrix that matches ability, um, the needs of the market and um, intelligence or, or preparedness uh, to make sure that we aren't doing everyone a disservice. Exactly. But also, Senator, maybe just demand. Hmm. Maybe if there are only 10 kids who want to do English literature, yep. it's only 10 kids who get to do it. It's not just because there's 20 spare spots. Let's keep casting around till we get to 30. Well, you know, I think we've got to a point in this country where it's almost being taught everyone's got to go to universities. There's a big focus on what are you going to do when you finish school? What are you going to study at uni? There are lots of other options for kids. There are lots of other alternatives, whether they go and get a trade or whether they go and work in, in, in something as an internship and work their yeah. way up. Not not everyone learns the same way and not everyone's good at everything. I was with a, a fabulous mathematician yesterday who said if kids aren't good at maths, they don't really have to do maths. If they're yeah. not great at English, don't make them focus on English. Let them focus on what they're good on. Well, of course, you could just completely fail at school yeah. and luck out and eventually host a national TV show. That could happen Which too. has kind of worked out for me for the past little while. <laughs> way smarter than me is none other than Rita Panahi. The reason we're in HD, she's on the telly right now. See you tomorrow.